And hello everyone, Greg Scott Bailey here. Welcome to my grind to Alpha 21. We're on, what was that, day 11? <laughs> yes, day 11. Uh, so I'm making some paint here real quick. Uh, we could do 400 out of that. I did make some gunpowder. Um, I'm gonna put the remaining Chris Anthems in there. Didn't get to organize everything as, as much as I wanted to, but that's all right. Could do some of that later. Well, here's some murky water here. Make some more paint. So basically, was just trying to uh, go ahead and turn this into a, uh, a plate deck. So I, I don't know. Part of me was thinking maybe I should just continue the same graded plate here instead of the um, I don't know the way it was making it, but. Uh, it, it's all it's all part of renovations. We'll decide it as it goes. Uh, one of the other things that I was doing is we're making some more forged iron as well. In order to make a crucible, we need 100 forged iron. We need 20 mechanical parts, 1,200 stone, 20 oil, and 900 clay soil. Seeing as how uh, we're still waiting for the trader to open up, let's do another morning here of both mining and digging. So I will be right back. Okay, so trader should be open now. We're almost at 1,200 stone. I know I have some stone back at the base as well, uh, but just to make sure we're gonna finish one more chunk here. And boom. All right, let's head back over to Trader Gens. Now, I'm starting to feel like the the jobs here aren't aren't quite giving us what we need. So with all due respect to Trader Jen, I think we're gonna turn this one in and we're gonna head over to Trader Joel and get some for that uh, town to the west here. So, Jenny. You're looking kind of rough. Here's your pay for a job well done. I'm looking kind of rough, but hey, I can have a level five sledge. Yeah, uh, she's trying to entice me, trying to get me to stay. <laughs> uh, we'll go ahead and pick up a job, but um, yeah, night only nearby. I think I've got a job or two. Actually, this is to the west. I had a good feeling about you. So it's over there, anyways. So we might be able to do a kind of a double whammy in that situation. Oh, when does she restock? Thirteen. And we did just level up day thirteen. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Maybe um, next time I'll have what you need. Maybe next time. Let's see what kind of points we want to spend. So I was waiting for two to get to strength seven. So next level up, we'll put into our uh, sledgehammers, our uh, skull crusher. And then after that, sexual tyrannosaurus will be maxed out as well. Um, actually, I might. That doesn't matter. Uh, but then we're going to want to get our mining and mother load up as well, because I want to start getting a lot more materials in return for what we're doing out there. Um, we got smoothie, eye candy. Health bar. Hmm. Can of chili. Just a little bit of stuff here or there. Can of chili. You know, we, we can make chili dogs later if we get the recipe. Um, yeah, let's drop this off here. I, I really do like this spot for some reason. It just looks really nice here. And I, I don't know what it is. Like, I just like something, something about converting this warehouse. We got a long ways to go to actually convert it. Uh, I've already got something else in mind for that uh, that section there. Oh, is this this is still damaged here? Yes. Uh, so real quick, I'll show you guys what happened here uh, while I go ahead and set this all up.
Okay, so Crucible is now started. Uh, paint is done. Awesome. And before I leave somewhere... No, actually, yeah. I take that back. <laughs> we're not, we're not going to paint just yet because, again, I, I, I'm i changing my mind every five minutes. I got to stop that. Um, okay, let's switch this to cube. Uh, the rest of this stuff, well, forged iron. Let's put the rest in here for now. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, head over to Trader Joel and see what jobs he has as well. Oh, excuse you. My goodness. And my God, she's still alive. <laughs> okay. Well, that's what I get for trying to run at her with low, uh, low stamina on a bicycle. All right, Joel, what you got for us, buddy? Now, we're going to want something that's west, southwest, or south, depending on the distance here. And uh, we'll go from there. What do you seek, friend? I seek a friend, friend. Okay. Uh, oh, right. We have to start with... I th Wait, I thought his... Uh, I thought all the traders have the next level when you unlock it. Is it only the trader you're working for? Well, shoot. I'm in a bit of a corn. Well, alrighty then. We might have to cruise through these, which shouldn't be too bad at this level, but still. Oh, wait. Did he have food, though? I think we are now officially out of the boiled meats. Click on the fork. Look at that. Grilled meats. Awesome sauce. Uh, we'll get all of his potatoes and animal fat, though. Because we are going to... Oh, look at cornmeal as well. We're going to need all that stuff for Thanks later for stuff, here. later uh, food projects anyways, the corn meal. You need it for the corn dogs, or sorry, not corn dogs, the chili dogs, which makes me think that they would be corn dogs, but I don't know, that's interesting. Uh, we still have the open trade routes for the third trader as well. Uh, let's talk about active. Which direction is that? Um, okay, so that's north, so we would have to be going north for three kilometers. I'm not ready to do that today, though. Uh, tier 1 fetch. So we're going for a salon down the road here. This gives us a chance to explore this new town and see what's in it. It looks pretty large. Uh, the distance is pretty nice. So let's see what we got down here. Alright, Zoe Salon. This is a familiar one. Should be pretty reasonable for us to run through it real quick. All right, start the quest and, oh wait, empty. Is that not part of the, uh... ooh, yeah, it was yellow. So this isn't considered, this parking lot's not considered part of it, is this? Yeah, because I looted these cars. Didn't get much out of them, but. <laughs> Glue. Golly. Who we got? Boop. Here's Johnny. Nice. And let's not use firepower too much. We we do want to save ammo. We're going to be doing fine with it, but yeah, you know, there's going to come a time where in a panic situation, we're going to wish we didn't use it up so easily or so um, inconsiderately. No, that's not the way I put it. <laughs> Just gonna be thankful that I don't use it up as quick. Right. And again, we're reading schematics. We already know. We're just gonna go ahead and get um, get the XP from them versus the money you can get from selling them. Interesting that I'm getting grills in these cupboards. Cash register. Okay, you get some dukes. Nice. A trash bin was... Still having some items in it. Cookie pots and grills in the salon. Hmm. I don't know what to make of that. 
Oh, sounds like a crawler outside. Aggro the zombie in another room. Oh, nerdy glasses. So, oh, there's another sewing kit. We can get some um, XP for that. Yeah, I'm going to change that to get away from agility now. Um, I'll go ahead and sell the goggles, though. Sniper scope, but that's another eight times mod. Oh, yes, yes, I'll get you. There you go. <laughs> uh, some of these things we don't need, so let's just scrap, scrap, scrap. Old school days, I used to actually hang on to the... Um, I used to hang on to the poncho for when we would go to the, the desert area. But uh, I don't don't really do that anymore. So I'm curious if, if any of you guys do that. If you go, go ahead and keep the variety of coats and ponchos and things. Do you, do you preemptively do those when you go to another zone? Or do you just kind of ride it out? Oh, poor bugger. He's been working so hard to get through that door. And I just go around behind him. Now, it says the satchel's over there. Did, did I miss it? No, wait. Up here. Oh, look at that. <laughs> okay, return to trader is active, but... Uh, we're going to kill the rest of the zombies on the roof. I, th I believe there's some up top. Uh, we did get those grilled meats. Now, those are only 10 food, just like the boiled ones are. But the downside is it doesn't give you the hydration like the uh, boiled meats. But who was I to refuse the, uh, the food in the first place if a trader has it to sell? What? That was totally honor. But that totally was on her too. There we go. All right, Fireman's Almanac. Do 10% more damage to coal and burnt wood. I don't know if that's really uh, helpful for us, but good anyways. Uh, scrap, scrap, grab. What's in here? What's in your wallet? Uh, let's see, we'll scrap, but we'll take, the, obviously, the arrows. We'll eat that. And that's another Iron Breaker mod. I'll grab it, we'll sell it, because we can only use one on our pickaxe. Oop. Hey, fellas. <laughs> I fell into a nest of you. Okay, only two of them. But yeah, it must have been a, a crawler horde. That's interesting. I don't think I've ever seen that before. We sell only the best merchant. Here is your reward. Only the best? Uh, let's see, Hunter's Journal. This one's 10% more against mountain lions, or I could get Molotovs. Um... You know, hmm. <laughs> I'm going to do the Molotovs. Why not? <laughs> uh, let's sell what I was going to sell. So the Iron Breaker, the goggles. We already have an eight times scope, so I'm going to sell that one. Sell these two items. Sell the dollars. Okay. Yeah, in some cases, like that level one wrench, if I, if I need another wrench, I can make one. Um... We're, we're at that point. We found that schematic, so it's 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 not really a ne necessity. Oh, he's got a level one steel sledge. Now we're not quite ready for that, but um, how, wait, how much does this do? Forty two. This does forty eight point six. Nah, 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 we're not gonna. We have to have the strength to be able to do that, so we're not ready. <laughs> um, yeah, we don't need batter up now. Mini bike. For 18,000 dukes. We just hit 10,000 dukes. Restock is day 13. It's possible we could just go ahead and buy a mini bike if we can scrap up, uh, scrounge up 8,000 more dukes. So let's see what we could do. Back now. Oh, we will. Um, not inventory. Come back tomorrow. We get new goods daily. Okay, so he does have tier ones. So this no is something I, again, I, I just didn't realize. I thought that. Um, I thought once you unlock the next tiers that it's unlocked for everybody. 
uh, being as how we have uh, a lot of stuff on us and we're not near base, uh, another crawler over there. Uh, another, we're not near base. Let's make a storage chest and leave stuff here. In fact, let's make two of them. Best to just uh, make sure we've got a couple of them set and ready to go. Uh, we have our our locked row lock mod. Yep. Uh, potato. So it's 11. Yeah, 9, 10, and 11. Oh, the frames. I was wondering what happened there. Okay. So next one's 300 meters. So let's just keep cruising and see how fast we can haul through a lot of these and unlock um, better quests. I, I think we are going to be moving over to Trader Joel here for the next big batch of jobs that we're going to end up doing. Plus, uh, whatever I'm going to do on my own as I continue to uh, level up and grind this character. Okay, so one of the nearby homes here. Oh, man, there's a, a fun little office building. So speaking of buildings we haven't been in or not sure if we've been in all of them. Uh, depending on what that is, I may never have been in that one. It doesn't look familiar, at least. Uh, so... Uh, just for future note, I'm going to have to check that out at some point. Uh, okay, so here is the spot. Uh, my sledge is almost done, but I think we can do this quest. So let's accept the uh, job. Let's go to the mailbox for one more session. Fake fanfare. Boop. Oh, my flashlight's been off. Shame on me. Uh, we'll scrap that. Now, there's a lot of cobble in this place, too. There's a lot of cobble in a lot of places. I think... I'm not hurting for it right now, but we do want to keep an eye out for, uh, oh, there's a satchel already. Uh, do we want the end loot or do we want to just go ahead and turn this in? I'm going to go ahead and turn this in. Yep. Yeah, let's do it. Let's, let's head back to the trader and get another one. It's quick dukes. If we really want to loot this house, we can always come back. Nothing like riding back through a rainstorm. Thank God a customer. <laughs> uh, bar brawling in volume seven. Uh, drinking beer no longer blurs your vision and your buzz lasts twice as long. Yeah, we'll get that one. We already got a, uh, what do you call it? Red tank. Uh, um, the the bigger tank mod whatever it's yeah called. <laughs> Can you help me with God? Pharmacy, that should be a fun one. Oh no, did he didn't have any more food because we bought out his food, right? Yeah, I don't see a icon for it. Uh, let's go ahead and eat that one more meat. So at the pharmacy, we're gonna have to see if we can get canned food there and and sustain ourselves. Usually by this time, I'm always putting at least a couple more points into cooking. Uh, well, when we have corn here, is this? Yes, I think this is the one where boars are gonna come out and attack me. Let's find out. There he is. We need the meats anyways. I said boars plural because I've had two boars come out of there and attack me before as well. But yeah, so this farm, uh, just always keep in mind it's got uh, <laughs> got a boar or multiple boars in this uh, shed here and once you go on a certain part of the property they aggro uh, but not only corn but there is I believe potatoes as well as well as hops yes that's right this is the the one that's got a variety of items Oop. hmm a level 5 baton Baton. Un baton. What a slide. Name the movie. Okay, lastly, I believe there's yeah, potatoes over here. There we go. Problem is, is seeing them. Sometimes it's hard to separate them, at least for my eyes. It's hard to separate them from the grass. I know. A couple of people we played with just immediately go right to them. They know exactly where they're at. They can see the difference. I 
I sometimes have a hard time seeing the difference. But uh, okay, so again, we're doing that where we get two crops per uh, pull. Obviously, it'd be nice to to get three, but uh, I think in a solo game, vanilla settings, everything's uh, not that difficult to get and create. It's how you manage yourself on it. Okay, that's it for needle and thread books. Uh, so the only thing we're missing now, I think, is the um, uh, the Ranger's Guide Volume Four for books. But let's head over to this next house and see what we got. Mr. Bunny Rabbit, careful, careful, buddy. I like good bunny karma, but I don't want you to get hurt. <laughs> uh, so behind the salon here. Got a couple work trucks. Uh, let's hit these up too while we're doing this. There's also um, working stiffs over there. I think I'm gonna do that after the pharmacy to see if we can get some better tools going. Uh, we already got that. There's a baton we could sell. Uh, what's the work trucks over here? Hey, buddy. Got the click, but that's uh, not this property. It's the next one over. Ooh, uh, junk tech junkie. Oh, that looks like the repulsor mod, I think. I had to read it quick and then <laughs> move on. There's a nurse. Yeah. Ambulance. No, no, it's another work truck. I thought this was going to be an ambulance. Uh, ooh, drone extra cargo mod. Nice. Okay. How you doing, buddy? Let's get a bleed wound on you. Let's juke you and swing and juke and swing. <laughs> oh my goodness. Now, I can't make a swing about 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 a swing because I didn't go clubs, but <laughs> Alright, what do we got over here? Um looks like we could probably park out here. I keep parking the vehicle off the POIs because I'm worried about them getting a reset. I don't know if that's still an issue or not. Um, but uh, yeah, let's semi double loot some of this stuff. I don't have a lot of space, but we're still gonna try to get some goodies while we can. Oh, right, I did leave some stuff in here. <laughs> so there's a shovel and a um, a uh, gun that a uh, pipe gun that we can sell to the trader. Silly me. Oh, let's read that. We're gonna sell that. You know, we could sell an electrical tool. I'm not gonna get much for it. Uh, let's drink that. Scrap that. Aloe seed we'll put in there. Okay. Yeah, let's anything else double up? Nope. Okay. Boy, these crawlers today. Awesome. Uh, let's check this car and then let's get going. Multiple cars. There we go. Repair kits are nice, so always good to check them. All right, here we go. Let's see what we get. Gotcha. Was he part of the POI? I don't feel like he was. All right, where are you guys at? Lumberjack. Oh, swing and a miss. Silly me. Man, we got him coming from everywhere. Okay, I was gonna say, I thought I heard another. Oh, probably from the roof. Oh, she's still alive. Not anymore. All right, so we're kind of double looting here. It's tier one. Should be hard to get through the zombies here. That's so I say. Uh, shovels we don't need. We'll scrap that. Okay, we got to be careful not to travel outside the uh, POI. Got him. All right, who do we have left in here? And this is a satchel return uh, retrieve as well. 
check shelves, see if we get some food while we get some medical supplies as well. There's some medical. So any food here? Nine. Jar of honey. Uh, some books. Nope. Well, nothing we haven't already read. Water cooler. And I'm going to drink the coffee, see if we get a stamina regen while we're working on stuff. All right, grab those. So we can scrap, drop that. Um, scrap that, drink that, scrap that. Play the condensing game again, get rid of the regular bandage. All right, nothing in the bathroom, just some loot. I do like getting medical stuff. Obviously, it becomes very handy later on. Okay, adrenaline, I'm gonna go ahead and use it. That way we're just moving faster. If we really need adrenaline, I hardly ever use it in the game. But if we ever really need it, we got some at home that we've gotten from before. Okay, chances are we're not going to be able to grab everything here. I'm going to leave it. Unless I really need it. Cooking grill, water. Okay, that's not lootable. Oh, more over here. All right, so we got a decent amount of aloe cream. Again, I'm gonna drop those bandages. I wouldn't mind the, um, if we take the vitamins now, I think we could have some stuff that might make us sick, like a sandwich or something, which I don't have right now, but yeah. There we go. Edgar and nurse. Oh, mister. Mister, buy that much. Take that arrow. And take her life. Okay. Oh, look at that. It's almost as if the game knew. Well, we're going to scrap that. I'm going to scrap the splint. And we're going to use this armor. Can we use it on here? Yes. Do need to keep an eye out for some better boots, though. Take that arrow. Okay, so Satchel's back downstairs. I didn't need to come up here, but we got some zombie kills at least. Uh, in the corner, look at that. Uh, what have we got? There we go. Just get rid of the grass. Grass is always greener on the other side. 1740. I don't know. I would like to hit hit that working stiff, but we... Oh, wait, that's a sham way. I thought it was a working stiff over there. No, there's the working stiff tools. Okay. Uh, we could try to see if I could drop off this stuff and come back. Let's see how much time we have left then. And then we'll uh, do a temporary uh, camp out over at this town. Okay, let's stop at the chest real quick and do a quick mass dump. We're going to sell. Sounded wrong. <laughs> Quick mass dump. Sell these items here. Oh, I can move so much faster. <laughs> I mean, I had the adrenaline thing, but I wasn't really feeling like it was affecting anything before. But oh, what can I get? Thank you, survivor. Help me find one. We'll take shotgun ammo. Here is your reward. Um. You know what? I just totally realized. Where did that sledgehammer go that we got for a reward? Um. You have a great day now. Well, let's get. Do you think you can help me with a funeral home? I don't think we'll have time for it, but. What in the world did I do with that level five sledgehammer? Oh no! <laughs> did I sell it? I didn't activate it. Well, what level can we make ourselves? Sledge. We can make a level four. 
I oh man, I'm gonna have to go back through the video and find out what I did with that um, that sledgehammer. Uh, so let's head to that working stiff tools and see how much time we have after that. Okay, working stiff tools. There we are. Uh, did we level up? We did. So when we turn stuff in, uh, skull crusher. I'm gonna do that, and then next level up, we'll go ahead and max out the uh, sexual tyrannus story. So who have we got in here? Now that we're almost maxed out on sledges, I'm curious how we're gonna do. We get some stamina regen from it, uh, from kills. But we still ex you know, we, we use up stamina when we do the uh Yeah, he's dead. Okay. Uh we use up stamina when we uh when we run, when we sprint, so you kinda have to toggle those sometimes. Puppy dog in the corner there. Okay, perfect. For a second I thought I didn't get him. All right, we're gonna loot afterwards. We just wanna make sure we got all the zombies here first. He still doesn't detect us, huh? Nice. Or she. Oh, there she is. Oh, I just missed it too. Missed it by that much. Hey, there's there's a good one to try to take out, and that somehow missed. Okay, <laughs> I just had to adjust. Once I saw how it arced from the distance, there it was easy to kind of gauge it. After that, all right. So the roof might be really active. So let's just be careful up here. Okay, not too bad. This one I've seen have a uh, zombie cop. Even at a low level before, but it didn't do it to us this time. I don't know if that's because when it's a job, it's different or what, but... All right, I think... That's it, and I think I hear a zombie monster. Oh! Oh, man. <laughs> that would have sucked. Uh, let's go ahead and get the loot and get on our way. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at what we got here. We got level six axe, level six hammer, level three shovel and iron pickaxe, uh, but we're already on those. Another pipe, uh, one to sell. So let's actually move these down here for sale. Oh, we never did sell these items because I was freaking out about that sledgehammer. Uh, what book did we get? Do 10% to more to vultures. I will gladly take that. Go ahead and eat that stew. And we got a bandolier mod, so that's going to help us with the quick draw action. So let's go ahead and equip that in favor of that oh what uh, what armor has some space the final frontier there we go awesome sauce okay so now we got a uh, better reload action at least a little bit thanks to that bandolier mod let's loot this place real quick with whatever miscellaneous loot and then we'll check back in in a moment All right, we got a safe. I'm gonna go ahead and try to pick the lock. We are on the last game hour of the day, though. Oh, one try. Oh, but that's all we get. That's why it was one try. Sounds like a lot of zombies out there. We have to find out what's up here in a moment. They probably will be breaking into the place. There's only like a chain link fence, really, in the way in some of those areas. Uh, we're going to eat that cat food, uh, grab the rest. Oh, vending machine. Uh, we don't really need anything else. I don't know. We should get jailbreaker suits. I want to go through those, those safes at the old town. Hey, they made it through. Let's juke him and boom. 
juke him and boom perfect yeah see so there's the chain link fence that they broke through like i said doesn't take much now if it were quote unquote real life zombies like you know if they were the george romero undead uh zombies um it'd be a little bit more difficult to get through I always love that about the zombie movies, though, if they're if they're done in the way that I think are right. You know, it's all subjective. But, um, you know, zombies don't really have much bone and uh, flesh strength. Obviously, if they're in greater numbers, they have much more ability to um, push on each other and therefore add weight distribution or whatever. Yeah, I, I get that aspect of it. But... Zombies don't have muscles and bone strength to get through concrete walls, <laughs> you know, like this game. Uh, it is one of my little downsides, but then at the other, other end of the stick, I, I understand, like, the difficulty. I'm not going to worry about the toilets. I understand the difficulty of trying to give players in a game a, a bit of an obstacle to overcome that increases challenges, increases... Uh, uh, gameplay and that's one of them is if, if the things you're fighting are no threat then what's the challenge in this aspect right so uh we don't need the paper cash register what was i skipping over there we go uh eat the sham sandwich drink the water gas grill and no no grilled meats shame Okay, so no big, huge tool things uh, out, out of this grab, but uh, other than, you know, we got these level six items, which, yeah, I should switch that over. Oh, creepy music time. We got to find us a spot to camp out. Um, technically, I could go back, back to the future. Could go back to my base uh, at this point. It's probably safe. Yeah, let's do it. So I'm going to take the long, dark road back, and we'll check back in in a moment. Whoo, howdy. Okay, stop in here real quick to uh, try to get some uh, items if we can. I don't know why I'm whispering, if it's you guys that I'm talking to. Oh, there's a big one. Oh, and he drops some loot, too. Look at that. Uh, book we already know. Scrap, scrap, and arm, uh, bullets will stack, so let's go back home. Okay, so that almost took a full game hour to get back. Uh, that's the kind of the downsides of that. But we made it back safely to our base. This way we can work on stuff during the night, and we're not just uh, waiting out a whole night sitting somewhere. Uh, so during the night, I will uh, find a couple things to work on. I'll update you guys uh, on what that project is when we do day 12. So thanks again, everybody, for coming out for day 11. I uh, want you to go ahead and click that subscribe button for me if you can. Uh, that uh, goal for 1,000 subscribers is not too far away if we collectively work together. Look at that. I'm empowering you. <laughs> now truthfully if you guys want to help out the channel i really appreciate it and hit that subscribe button click the bell notification next to that button and that will no help you get notified every time i post new videos if you like or even dislike this video go ahead and click the thumbs up or the thumbs down depending on your feelings and reactions on that and don't forget to comment below let me know your thoughts on this series and where it's going and what your thoughts are for alpha 21 movie talk whatever uh, go ahead and post that below let's get the conversations going i love and appreciate each and every one of you and as always we'll see you on the next adventure all right bye bye